sent me straight to the lost city. Now, prepare to die. There are just hundreds of snakes in this temple just waiting for us to show up. What? Why aren't they biting that guy? This is ridiculous. Delete. 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 Hi friends today, I am going to review a new action movie The Lost City. I actually enjoyed this film way more than I expected. It perfectly fits into its categories of action, adventure, comedy, and romance. The story was very enjoyable. It started off kind of wonky and felt like I was in for a bad time. But once the prologue passed and the main portion of the movie started it got much better. The chemistry between Sandra Bullock and Channing Tatum worked surprisingly well and only got better as the film progressed. I did enjoy Daniel Radcliffe as the antagonist. More of a bratty rich boy than an evil I want to murder everyone kind of bad guy. The first half of this movie is really funny. I was laughing more than most in the theater. There are so many well-written jokes and situational humor with about an 80% hit rate, including a few hilarious moments. The characters are fleshed out enough for me to care, the story is formulaic and relatively weak compared to the other aspects, but that's easily forgiven when it's making me laugh. In the second half, the laughs slow down drastically. It gets a lot more serious with attempts at character arcs and story moments that aren't bad but are things we've seen a thousand times. I didn't hate watching it, but without as much comedy it's a much weaker movie. By the end I felt that the big part of the film was that the romance was definitely geared towards the women while the action parts were geared towards the men, the comedy could have gone either way, and some may find certain parts funnier than others. Both scenes and what's actually funny, I also enjoyed the score. The way certain soundtracks were worked into the scenes noticeably helped enhance them, as soundtracks should. Three, two, one. Here's a trailer for the Lost City. Here's a trailer for the Lost City. Screw you, man. Overall, I think this film is perfect for a movie date night. It's funny, it's romantic, it has a pretty good action adventure story, and it's not as cheesy as most rom coms tend to be. I hope my review helps you make a choice on this film. Until next time, enjoy the show. Take care.